Welcome to StockInvest YouTube channel and this stock report for Apple. The stock report was first published on StockInvest on 3 September 2021. In this stock report we give you all the key information you need to know about Apple for the upcoming trading day on Tuesday 7. Knowledge is money, and this report is all about giving you information about support and resistance levels, signals, chart analysis, price to earnings ratios, and possible trading levels for Apple. Please remember to subscribe. Like and hit the notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new video. Enjoy this unique report for Apple and please make sure you get our conclusion and forecast at the end of the video. In this section you will get general information about Apple performance. The Apple stock currently holds a 5.373 score, and our system have ranked Apple buy or hold candidates since the 4th of June 2021. If you were following our analysis you would have had an amazing gain of 22.57% since we first told you to buy Apple 65 days ago. This is an average return of 0.35% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Apple our last headline reads Green Day on Friday for Apple. The Apple stock price gained 0.42% on the last trading day, Friday 3 September 2021 rising from $153.65 to $154.30, and has now gained four days in a row. It will be exciting to see whether it manages to continue gaining or take a minor break for the next few days. During the day the stock fluctuated 1.01% from a day low at $153.09 to a day high of $154.63. The price has risen in 6 of the last 10 days and is up by 4.12% over the past 2 weeks. Volume fell on the last day by minus 13 million shares and in total, 58 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $8.90 billion. You should take into consideration that falling volume on higher prices causes divergence and may be an early warning about possible changes over the next couple of days. The Apple Stock Trends and Predictions The current Apple trends the stock lies in the middle of a strong rising trend in the short term and a further rise within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend indicate a 18.23% change over the next three months. From a statistical point of view, a possible return between 16.42% and 26.11% from today's price. The 12-month trend it indicate a 23.93% change over next 12 months with a possible return between 6.74% and 31.08%. This equals a price between $164.71 and $202.25 after a year. Price predictions from StockInvest users. In addition two users says buy. Price predictions from our algorithms for next 5 trading days. Wednesday 8th close at $157.81. Thursday 9th close at $158.21. Friday 10th close at $158.60. Monday 13th close at $159. Tuesday 14th close at $159.39. Analyst ratings on Friday September 3rd 2021 Wedbush set target to $185. On Thursday, September 2, 2021, JP Morgan Chase & Co. set target to $180. On Tuesday, August 31, 2021, Fundamental Research set target to $144.27 to $163.99. On Monday, August 30, 2021, UBS Group set target to $175. From analysts, Apple stock receive a general strong buy. The analysts give P.E. ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy. For the return on investment the analysts give the Apple stock in neutral. Signals and forecast. Mostly positive signals in the chart today. The Apple stock holds buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $151.65 and $148.06. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Wednesday, August 18, 2021, and so far it has risen 5.42%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three months moving average convergence divergence, MACD. 
Volume fell during the last trading day despite gaining prices. This causes a divergence between volume and price and it may be an early warning. The stock should be watched closely. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a buy signal pivots gave a sell signal 13 days ago Bollinger gave a buy signal 1 day ago short moving average for the 3 month chart gave a buy signal 7 days ago. The long term moving average for the 3 month chart gave a buy signal 60 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages in the 3 month chart gave a buy signal 59 days ago. If we look at the 12 month chart we see, short moving average gave a buy signal 6 days ago. The long-term moving average gave a buy signal 60 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages gave a buy signal 55 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support. Risk and stop loss for Apple. Apple finds support from accumulated volume at $149.15 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. In general the stock tends to have very controlled movements and with good liquidity the risk is considered very low in this stock. During the last day, the stock moved $1.54 between high and low, or 1.01%. ,01%. For the last week the stock has had a daily average volatility of 1.71%. In this section we will give you important key values for Apple to up your trading game. The price to earnings ratio, P-E ratio, is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per share earnings. Apple currently has a price earning ratio of 29.38. This is a relatively normal price to earnings ratio and often seen in business with long track record or predictable revenues. Here are some possible good day trading levels. The stock does not have any resistance from accumulate volume above and may therefore move very fast upwards given the right conditions. You should therefore enter the stock and use volume to determine when to exit. On a downturn Apple finds first level of support at $149.15 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounds upwards. Other levels you should watch based on the famous Fibonacci model are buy at $153.42. $153.05. $152.47. Sell at. $154.59. $154.96. The latest analyst ratings for Apple. On September 3, 2021, Wedbush gave $185 rating for AAPL. The price target was set to $153.65 plus 0.7%. The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for Apple is Strong Buy If you would like to go deeper, here is some information about Apple. Apple Inc. designs, manufactures, and markets mobile communication and media devices, personal computers, and portable digital music players to consumers, small and mid-sized businesses, education, and enterprise and government customers worldwide. The company also sells related software, services, accessories, networking solutions, and third-party digital content and applications. It offers iPhone, a line of smartphones, iPad, a line of multi-purpose tablets, and Mac, a line of desktop and portable personal computers. The company also provides iLife, a consumer-oriented digital lifestyle software application suite, iWork, an integrated productivity suite that helps users create, present, and publish documents, presentations, and spreadsheets, and other application software, such as Final Cut Pro, Logic Pro 10, and FileMaker Pro. In addition, it offers Apple TV that connects to consumers' TV and enables them to access digital content directly for streaming high-definition video, playing music and games, and viewing photos. Apple Watch, a personal electronic device, an iPod, a line of portable digital music and media players. Our recommended stop loss, $147.40, minus 4.47%. This stock has low daily movements and this gives low risk. There is a buy signal from a pivot bottom found 12 days ago. Is Apple stock a buy? Apple holds several positive signals and is within a strong rising trend. As the old saying says, let the trend be your friend.
We therefore consider it to be a good choice at these current levels and we are expecting further gains during the next three months. Analyzing the volatility and movements for last trading day our systems find that current price is overvalued. For the trading on Tuesday 7th we expect Apple to open down minus 29 cents and start trading at $154.01. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.